Hello everybody and welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Dr. Zia Kumawa and today we're going to be talking about waist trainers. Have you ever wondered if waist trainers truly work? Do they really do what they say they do? Will they really permanently reduce belly fat, like make you to be, to have a figure eight? Will they do that? So this video, if you're interested in that, watch this video until the end. If you're here and you don't even know what a waist trainer is, let me help you. A waist trainer is like a corset or a girdle. It, the producers or people who, who developed it, they claim that it helps you, that it's going to make you to have a figure eight, to have a, an hourglass shape, and it's going to permanently reduce body fat or belly fat. So that's what the waist trainer is and many people use it like it's so it's everywhere but do they really work? Do they really work? I came here with a lot of research or I came here with a lot of material Maybe I've compressed it, but I think I came here loaded now waist trainers Will not the first thing let's just start with it. Let's go straight to it. Waist trainers will not permanently reduce uh, belly fat there if you're thinking that you I don't know in one month or as you put it on you're going to immediately or permanently have a, an hourglass shape but it, it is not like that it will not permanently reduce but in, in fact when you use a waist trainer it will make you to have a, a nice figure while you're putting it on but immediately you take it off your body goes to normal you have to relax you cannot wear a waist trainer 24-7 while you're putting on your waist trainer you will have a, a good shape or a good figure but when you take it off give it a couple of hours or a couple of minutes and your body will go back to what it was before that's if your main aim of using a waist trainer is to reduce belly fat so yes you're going to be happy for those minutes or those seconds but permanently no it does not work like that they will claim it works like that, but no, it doesn't. Now, how do these garments or the waist trainer, how does it supposedly work? So they they explain that if you train your abdomen, like if you're, you're training your body, it can, it can yield to the training and get to the form that you want. So we understand that the waist trainer has a, a sleek shape and it's nice and when you put it on, it gives you that figure so if you can train your body for a month or two your body can pick that format up like can pick up that form and you will be exactly what you want to be so that's how it supposedly works that's how it is explained now let's talk about why this training is not so good especially if you're using it for a very long time you see people two months they buy you buy waist trainers and you have it for life all the time people are wearing uh, putting on waist trainers now so we're going to bring out some of the points like why it's not good to wear the waist trainers all the time and some people say you should put on the trainers when exercising it's not advisable to, to use your trainers when exercising and i'll explain all of that. when you're using waist trainers what has, what happens is that the the trainer puts a lot of pressure your on your abdomen and even your the organs in your in your stomach there we have your your stomach itself we have your liver your kidneys your intestines all those organs that are there what happens is the trainer squeezes them so it's just like you're squeezing your your very important organs there so this this pressure that you're putting at times it, it puts a pressure on your stomach such that you feel as as though you're full all the time you, you don't want to eat because you just have that feeling of fullness. And that's why you see people coming by, hey, gastric, this gastric, that, because many people use waist trainers are probably on some um, fast intermittent fasting diet that will just, that worsens their, their, their acute gastritis. We have a lot of cases of acute gastritis right now. And this is one of the causes. You're putting on your waist trainers, you're feeling like you're full, you're not eating, and you come gastric. And we are there treating and treating and treating and you're putting on your waist trainers and that's it we're wasting our time so yes it puts a lot of pressure on your abdomen now there are these important organs at times you, you when you squeeze on it there are possibilities for them to change form or to like to have a serious injury in them that will cause 
you to have serious problems later on i will not even know that it was a waist trainer that caused it you can also have a fracture you can fracture your ribs you can you literally can fracture your ribs from a trainer we've seen um videos where people pass out while using their waist trainers when you put on your waist trainer for so long when you put on your waist trainer for so long, you also have difficulties breathing. It's like you're, you're, you're fighting for air, you're gasping, you're, you're, you're looking for air. And because you're looking for air, imagine you putting on a waist trainer, looking for air because you cannot breathe well, then you're exercising. Even during exercising, you need oxygen, you need a lot of oxygen. So you're just depriving yourself. It's too much, it's too much now, it's too much. That is why people pass out. People, you see somebody, you see somebody standing on the street and the person will just pass out. It's wrong use, bad use of say, Not everything can be 100% bad. <laughs> we have some very good uses of waist trainers. You should know that waist trainers are not a thing of today. Oh, they've been there. It's just that they've been changing names. Before it was corset, we have girdles, and now we, we are calling them waist trainers. Now, Waist trainers can give you a good posture, like the way you stand. Yes, it can give you it can give you a good posture, but too too much of everything is a problem. So too much of it is good. Waist trainers are also good after delivery for women who have just put to bed. Um, there was a study that was done. Women who put to bed uh, through cesarean section or through operation, when they use waist trainers, they, they, they bleed less and the pain reduces. Whether you even had a cesarean section or not, if you use a waist trainer post delivery, your, your, you bleed less and the pain, after pain, it helps with the after pain. This one is, is, is studies have shown it there. It's helped a lot of women. In fact, waist trainers are like the, are like the Western version of, 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 uh, of your mom or your mother-in-law tying tie your stomach after delivery they, that one they, they tied on it's like you cannot even breathe but it should not be so hard but it's the same thing it's in the same family all of it is applying pressure under your abdomen you help with the pain and it's going to help you because you should know that i have put a waist trainer before i tried so because before doing this video i i had to just experience it I've, I've bought a waist trainer before, yes, and when I use it, I feel like, ah, but after a while when I take it off, everything just, it just falls down. <sighs> to everybody selling waist trainers out there, I'm just giving medical facts. Don't hate. Please don't hate. And if you've not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe, like, share, and comment. Thank you. Bye-bye.